Hey guys! Hey! It's Maya and welcome back to the Chan Chan. <laughs> so, as you know, I am unhinged. And with me having an unhinged mind, I was just sitting in my room and I started thinking. And then it came to me. I had an epiphany. So I was like, what if I do an Are You Smarter Than a Fifth Grader quiz? Me, an idiot. <laughs> but you know, I had to switch it up. Make it a little spicy. What if I took the quiz while I was drunk? Damn, I got the Hennessy! Oh so yeah, that's what today's video is. Enjoy. So obviously, before we start the quiz, I obviously have to get drunk. And um, I have the tools to do that. So today we have an ounce of water. It's about to get spicy up in here. And then I have my chaser from Dunkin. All my ice melted. But it's cute. It's cute. I'm ready. You ready, baby? I'll do it. Just don't enjoy it. It's not an enjoyable experience for me, and I don't like any of you. Okay. All right, you stay back there. Alright, so if I'm being honest, I think where normally where I start to feel something or I start to get a little woozy is around five. I'm just gonna go for it, take five straight from off the bottle, use my chasers, and then we're gonna get right into it. Mm. Y'all know that one girl in the club that got that me mug? You feel like you feel like you have the vibe to go over there, but like she got that nasty ass me mug. This is her. What, what more, more do you, do you want, want from me? me? Y'all, I'm sweating. I'm genuinely sweating right now, and I'm only three deep. All right. That's five. All right. Now that we're five shots deep, let's get into this quiz. What y'all are thinking? Why do you have your glasses on? And now, one, I'm off the lick. Two, these are my thinking glasses and I need all the thoughts I can get. You know how Steve from Blue's Clues has his thinking chair? But I need my thinking glasses. All right, first question. Which continent is the most populated? We have Africa, Asia, Europe, South America. And just looking from the answers, I know that China or Japan, I'm, I forgot which one, but one of them is one of the most populated countries in the world. I think it's China, if I'm not mistaken. But um, I'm gonna go with Asia, period. Thank you, thank you. BBL Drake. I need the mock swing. Sodium represented in the periodic table of elements. Well, for one, I know this off the top of the door. Even it's NA. Don't don't say nothing. I know it's right. What I said. What I said. Did I lie? Did I lie? Did I lie? Did I fucking lie? What's the scientific name for the upper arm bone? So obviously your femur is in your leg. Obviously there's radius, which is this part, and then there's ulna, which is that part, but it's just like the, it's the skinny bone side. Humorous, it's gotta be, it's gotta be. If I'm wrong, hold it against me. Call me dumb in the comments, I'll say it. Yes sir, what I said, what I said, it's the humorous, huh? Humor me. Eyes are equal in an isosceles triangle. So I know that in, I remember my triangles, I remember obtuse, I remember a Q, and I remember a right angle triangle, right? A right angle triangle, it's like two sides, cause you got this side and then you got this side. And then you got the side that go like this, but obviously this is the side that makes the 90 degree angle, right? I don't remember what isosceles means, like I don't recall her. We got three, we got one, we got zero, we got two. I'm thinking isosceles is not a triangle because triangle all sides are equal and it's all three sides. So three, getting packed up. I don't think a triangle can just have one side that's equal. Honestly, I don't know what isosceles means, so I'm gonna go with zero because it sounds like it's a triangle that's not equal. There's two equal sides in an isosceles. Uh, let's just laugh at him now. <laughs> Each is the word quickly. So we got adjective, adverb, noun, and proposition. Adjective is a describing word, like pretty, beautiful, you know, describing words. I remember adverb is an action word. We got noun, don't tell me. Y'all know what a noun is, person, place, or thing. Hello, even off the lick, I remember that. Thank you, Texas, thank you. 
And a uh, proposition, I'm I don't remember what that is, but I think it's like a word. Well, no fucking shit. I know quickly is an adverb. We got Texas, Alaska, Cali Montana, and California. Alaska, cause I don't really know a lot of people that live in Alaska like that. Tana, I don't think Montana has a lot of people like that. Like she's kind of like, ain't she like shaped like this or something? We know Texas, shaped like the boot on the map. Big dog on the map. Everything's larger and bigger. You know, that's my home, that's my home state. So obviously I'm gonna go with Texas. <laughs> Look this up. Let's look into this. Alaska is the biggest state. Oh, it's 50 states very widely in size. One is by far the biggest, Alaska. Dang! Yeah, she, yeah, she got that. Mm -hmm. She ate that. Next question, please. Describes the following principle. An object in motion stays in motion, while an object at rest stays at rest. Sir, I it. Wait. Um, I mean... <laughs> He came up with those principles. Newton's laws of motion. An object at motion will stay in motion. And an object at rest will stay at rest. Hello, inertia, baby, inertia. Period, 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 period. Fraction one third multiplied by one third equal to. I forgot how to multiply fractions, y'all. Like multiply it by the reciprocal. One over three and then three over one. Well, I was never good at math, so what we not finna do is eat me up. I was never good at math. Figurative language. Does she was as sly as a fox used? So we got personification, which is, you know, giving lifelike human human actions, features, or things humans can do to an animal. A simile, which is using like or as. We have a hyperbole, extreme exaggeration, and we have an illusion. I forgot what that means, but I know this is obviously a synonym, a, a, a simile. A simile. What kind of animal is a turtle? Off the rip, mammal has hair. I don't think a turtle got hair. It's either a reptile, amphibians are frogs, so it gotta be a reptile. Animal Planet, every morning before I went to school, I was gonna get that right regardless. At what temperature does water boil? I don't remember this. I'm a guess. I think it's this one. Ah! Are you dumb? There's no way I had that brain fart, bro. There's no way. Whoa, 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 whoa. For an eight out of 10, you might be smarter than a fifth grader. Might is crazy. Might is crazy. Am I or am I not? Les gens ont les hoppas, les chisons, les...